Hello guys, I've got a bit of a random haul for you today. So I did a collaboration with Superdrug for their Dare magazine, where basically they gave me a Superdrug card loaded with points to go and buy stuff and then share with them what I bought, which is always a nice kind of collaboration to do. So this video isn't in collaboration with them at all. <laughs> I don't know how many times I've just said collaboration, but I just thought it'd be quite nice just to show you guys what I got because I never go into Superdrug, I never think to go in there like, when I think of toiletries and stuff, I think of boots. Yeah, I was very pleasantly surprised with the stuff that I've got and the range of stuff that they had. And I just thought I'd share it with you because, because I don't know, you might not like this, but it might be your cup of tea. So we shall see. Okay, so firstly, I got lots of baby stuff because being a mum, going into a drugstore. What's the English? Drugstore's like an American term, isn't it? I don't know, whatever you call it. Yeah, you pretty much got to stock up on baby stuff. So I got two packs of Pampers nappies. The other one has already been tucked into. So we just get the size five baby dry ones. I tend to just get whatever size five ones are the best deal at the time. Don't really know the difference between like baby dry and, well, I don't know active fits more for like moving around and stuff, but yeah, Jasper just wears whatever ones. As long as they're Pampers, because Pampers are my go-to. These were two for 12 pounds, which, it's quite a good bargain. I then picked up a couple of packets of baby wipes as well. Again, just Pampers. They were the cheapest ones there, but they are my go-to because sometimes I find the Huggies ones kind of rip a bit. Okay, I then picked up two things of the Aveeno cream. So for those of you that don't know, Jasper had eczema and dermatitis really, really badly when he was little. Yeah, it was just so bad. I've done quite a few videos on it because we literally tried a million and one things and this was our lifesaver. So it's the Aveeno cream, there's an Aveeno moisturizer, Aveeno lotion, there's like a few different ones and we tried a few of the range and it was when we switched to the cream, that's when it was just amazing. And I find it really difficult to find this sometimes, like even in the pharmacies, sometimes boots don't do it, supermarkets, so it's good to know that Superdrug do the exact one that I want. Uh, so I got one for me and then one for my mum as well. So two of those. I also got some Child's Farm hair and body wash. We were sent a sample of this ages ago and it's over 98% naturally derived ingredients. It's suitable for sensitive and eczema prone skin and it's won loads of awards and stuff. So that is really, really good. I love the sample. So yeah, as soon as I saw it, I was like, I'm gonna get some of that as well because even though his skin is so good now, and to be honest, I could probably stop using the Aveeno because if I have a day where I don't use it, or a couple of days, like his skin is just so good at the moment, I just wanna to stick to organic stuff because, I don't know, it's just, there's no harm in it, is there? Also got the boys some plasters, they're obsessed with animals at the moment. Don't really know if it's them that's obsessed or me with like safari animals, it's their birthday party theme. So I just got some little plasters with all safari animals on. And then I let Jasper pick out some bits and he went for the four to six month old cow and gate fruit pouches. I just think with these, like, they might not be the most beneficial for him, but they're not bad for him, and they're really good just to have on the go. Um, and he also chose these ones, which he used to have when he was teeny, but they are four to 36 months, so it's up to three anyway. They're just full of fruit, so I just think anything like that is good to have in your cupboard, just to eat on the go. And I chose some Ella's Kitchen, very yummy yogurt Greek style pouches, these are from six months, but again, like if we're just in the car and he's hungry and I've realised that he hasn't had any fruit or veg in the day, then I just give him one of these and it just makes me feel a little bit better. He chose some strawberry and apple organics goodies gummies. So it's really good. Super Drug do like a lot of the baby ranges, which is always good. Um, Jasper also wanted a new toothbrush, so I got him and Reese one. I find that like they'll have them in the bath and Jasper will dip it in the bubbles and I sit him on the toilet, like, with the lid down to brush his teeth so I can kneel on the floor and sometimes he'll, like, wave it around and it'll touch, like, the sides or he'll drop it on the floor. So I think it's good to update them quite regularly. And these are just the 0 to 3 soft ones and they stick to a surface. So I thought it was a little bit fun as well. That's everything for the boys. And then I got a few bits for me. I thought I got loads for me and then I got home and I was like, actually, I don't really have that much, but it's fine. So I got the collab. What's her name? Ruth Crilly? Is it Ruth Crilly? Yeah, who's a fashion model and blogger. It's her range of dry shampoo. And I actually saw this on a Zoella vlog ages ago. I think Zoella had had like a panic attack and couldn't go to the launch party. So Alfie went, oh my God, this is like some weird little story. But anyway, this, and it smells really good. It's the tropical fruity one. I got some cotton pads, some new micellar water because mine ran out. 
This was on buy one get one free. So I picked one up for my mum as well. I got a beauty blender because I've just seen them on so many different vlogs and makeup tutorials and I thought I should give it a go and I actually used it this morning. I don't know if you can tell it's been used. I'll put it back in the box for the video. I also picked up some simple kind to skin antibacterial hand wash. And then lastly, you probably won't be interested by this, but some advanced men's 50 plus tablets for my dad because I just said to him, I'm going to super drug if there's anything you want and he was like, vitamins for my age and some Vitapoint which is leave-in hair conditioner and it reminds me of home because it's always in the cupboard my dad uses it every day so um yeah if you're a male over 50 or you want to get something for your dad these might be useful so that's it those are my bits from Supercharg I don't think that the magazine article will be out by the time I finish this video but if it is I'll leave a link below and if not I'll add it in later and I hope you liked it if you like this kind of video let me know and I'll start doing more like shopping hauls from drugstores and supermarkets and stuff like that. Thanks for watching guys, please don't forget to like and comment and subscribe and I'll see you next time, bye!